Small! Get in here. Okay. Bring it in. Uh, <clears throat> hello. I don't know what you're doing out there. What are you doing out there? Uh, I don't just, yeah. Because in my mind, uh, soccer's played with a ball. Uh, right? I wasn't trying. I was trying to run towards the goal. You're not getting points by running through the goal post. The ball has to go through. Brennan, I'm going to show you something, all right? Mm -hmm. Maybe this will give you a little incentive. All right. Look at my arm right there. See that? Yeah. I got that when I was 18 years old. Uh, I'll tell you something. Yeah. I regret it. Because this tattoo don't come off. Right. I have a tattoo of a cow's head because I love that cheese then. So I get the cow, I go in there, I'm a little drunk. And I say, give me that cow head from that cheese. I love that cheese. Uh-huh. I have a cow, a cheese cow on my arm, Brendan. Don't get a tattoo. That's what I'm telling you. <laughs> okay. Play soccer. Brendan, take a look at my chest. I gotta go, Mr. McGurk. No, I'm serious. Look at that. No, that's nice, Mr. You know what really that is right there? That's the, the woman from the Chiquita <laughs> Banana. I got that tattooed on my chest. I'm an idiot. I got trademark products all over my body. It's like going to a market because I was drunk one night. Wow. Don't live like me. Right. All right? Now you go out there and play great. You know what? I'm going to crack the egg. I'm going to crack the egg because if you do it, you're going to drip it all down the side of the bowl. I know, I know not on purpose. Honey, mommy can't deal with spills. No, uh, I just, Mom, Mom, guess what? I got my. I finished the preview for my movie. I'd really like to. to, to please, would you please look at it, please? Yeah. Please, Mom. Please, yes, please, please, yes. Please, please, please. Go ahead, show me. Okay, here it goes. It's a. Uh, What's it called? Uh, it's called the, the Dark Side of the Law. In a world. Turns out your old partner has gone dirty. Gone mad. He's gone dirty? He's a dirty cop. There stands one. People don't understand me. I wanted to make a difference. Cop! Jason, we, we went to the academy together. Fighting! You were a good cop. Don't try to sweet talk me! Against evil. I set up the bomb then with 3,000 wires. And and if you cut the wrong wire, the bomb explodes. Injustice. Think, Melissa. Blue or red? All right, here we go. Clip. Dark side of the law. What do you think? That's... Huh? You know, is it too early to start writing the speech? Yeah, well, I, you know, I'd I like to thank my mother. Yeah, no, don't worry. You're in there somewhere. Uh -huh. yeah. That's my mother in the back row with the damp cloth. Hey, uh, Brent, can I tell you something? Uh, mm -hmm. It's kind of weird. I mean, it's that's not that big a deal. I, I want to let you know that I'm I'm going to go out tonight. Mm -hmm. Where are you going? I'm going to go on a date. Are you going on? Yep. Mom, um, I don't remember that uh, you're supposed to do that. I thought that you, what you do is not do that. Women are supposed to go on dates, especially newly divorced women. They're mm. supposed to spring uh, forth well, and, uh, and think about uh, life and youth. I am absolutely you. supposed to go on a date. I've been hiding my light <laughs> under your under your dad's bushel. Uh, Mom, that's making me... I'm a little... Wait, wait, there's one more thing. I want to tell you who I'm going out with. <laughs> I'm going out with... Uh, Mr. McGurk. Come again? Mr. McGurk. My soccer coach? Yes, Brendan, yes. T we... Um, oh, wait, wait, what, what? Your mom's going on a date with... Yes, McGurk. McGurk the jerk. I don't understand. It's... Let me tell you about women a little bit, Melissa. Hey, guys. Hi, Dad. Hi, Eric. Nice sandbox, pal. <laughs> I'm kidding. No, it's uh, aren't you too too old to be playing in a sandbox? I'm not playing though. I'm I'm sitting in a sandbox. This is where I come mm -hmm. to reflect on things. And you're looking for. Uh... I'm looking for answers to questions. Mm -hmm. I'm looking for solutions to problems. I, I am. I came out here and I've been digging up things and I found this. Ew. Oh, gross. And I don't know. Yeah, who's... I think you should bury that again. What's going on, Brendan? I'm kind of in a bad mood. Missy, we gotta get going. Tell my dad, maybe he could help. You know how you pick us up and Coach McGurk's there, that mm -hmm. big, fat, crappy Irish guy? Well, I don't think that's... The, yeah. I mean, that's not the problem. Right. The problem that is that he's dating my mom tonight, going out on a date. Mm-hmm. That, that's... See, you have so much going on, so many things to be, to be happy about. No. You know, Melissa tells me about your ideas for movies. Has, mm. I've seen some of your early work, and it's wonderful. Well, thank you. Yeah. Uh, what was your favorite one? Don't put me on the spot, please. I'm sorry. I, 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 you know, I just I, I'm, I appreciate <clears throat> the gesture. Well, Melissa, we have to be at, at Mr. Luck's studio in 10 minutes. In 10 minutes? Yeah. We have what, made a commitment. What, what are you guys talking about? <laughs> We're going to play at this recital in three weeks, Melissa and I, and we've been practicing this sonata. It's a Mozart piano and violin sonata. I, I didn't even know you played violin, Eric. 
I um, told you about yeah, the I, I'm like constantly learning things about you. Well, this is only the first thing. Yeah, I mean, this is the first thing I've ever we're, learned. We're but playing I mean, a, a sonata in E maybe minor. Maybe Brendan doesn't Mozart. have time right no, now. No, no, I'd, I'm going to hear this. He's got a lot on his mind. No, Dad, Dad, put it away. That's, that's I like that. Yeah. I I feel strangely like cheered up by your playing. <laughs> it's a new awkward feeling that I'm gonna have to deal with. I think I'm, I'm like a minstrel, I guess. I almost, you know what? No, no, I don't. I like to go into this date with almost a chip on my shoulder. Uh -huh. How dare he ask me out? How dare anybody put me through this? What are you wearing? I'm wearing just. This is my feeling. Right now, I'm at the precipice of my life. I'm, 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 I'm at a turning point. I've decided that I'm just going to go dressed how I am dressed, because otherwise, it's almost false advertising. I'm wearing a, a big baggy pants and a shirt that makes a man want to buy me another shirt. Yeah, yeah. I think I have just the right attitude, don't you? Is that what you're wearing tonight? Yeah, this is a seersucker jacket. It's very nice. Yeah, but it's, do you think it's in season? Don't be a wise guy, all right? <laughs> what, are you a dumb guy, huh? No, what, are you, what are you talking about, Brendan? I don't know. You don't mess with me, all right? Yeah, I'll mess here. with you. You, you like, can I get you something? What, what do you, you drink? No, I'm fine. You have, you like a whiskey? No, I had a couple of whiskeys before I got here. You smell like it. You smell like it. Listen a... to me, Brendan. I want this date with your mom and I to go well, all right? All right. Don't mess it up. You know what? Can I give you a piece of advice? Don't take the jacket off because you're starting to sweat through it. And then they see the shirt underneath it. You're just going to look like sweat man. Yeah, Unless you get the whole thing wet. There's nothing wrong with sweating if you're a man. That's what happens. Oh, my God. Have you met my sister? <laughs> no, I haven't. She's very cute. I'd like to say hi to her. Hello. You, get, you know what? You're kind of a lucky guy. What you come that? in here, you got, a, you got a family already, right? This is, whose kid is this? I don't know, yours now, <laughs> right? No, that's, not, that's not the way it's going to yeah, be. Yeah, it's the way it's going to be, isn't it? Yeah. You know, Brendan, I know what you're doing. You know how to hold a child? Well, Have you ever held a baby and had it look at you like it really loves you and you know, needs you? Brendan, I'll tell you something right ever now, all right? I know what you're that? trying to do. Yeah. Oh, yeah? I know what you're trying to do, uh -huh. and that's not going to work. Can you, seriously, can you carry me for a second? I'm not going to carry you. Listen, Get your hands off me, Brendan. Please, come on, Dad. I better go. No, come on, let's play a catch. Tell your mom I don't feel Seriously, it. I think I love you. I swear to God, I'm going to come down harder on you on Monday. It's going to be like a friggin' hurricane. Oh, yeah? Yeah, I'm going to take you. Hello, oh, hey, Paul. Mom, I was just talking to Brendan, having a nice yeah, conversation. We had a really good talk. <laughs> Are you ready to go? Of course, that's not it. I mean, that's not the only thing that goes into coaching, having big legs. Uh. I think I just ate a whole clove of garlic. Woof. Well, well, look, you know what it, you know what it is? I mean, I think mm -hmm. I, I don't want to get into a whole conversation about uh, anything. Yeah. But um, <laughs> I come from a family that, that was split up. Yeah. Uh, it can be hard on a kid. I remember having the same feelings, you know? Yeah. It's why I dropped out of school, which I expect Brendan might do someday. I mean, I, you, know, you never know what's going to happen when, uh, when a family falls apart. It's a prison. Right. And, and then... I'm coming to visit you in the prison because I'm your yeah. mother. Yeah. You feel horrible for what I've done. I've done something terrible. How come we're in France? Because that's where dramatic things take place. Okay. Right, okay, here goes. Guard! Guard! Yes. Hello, guard. Hello. I could use some water and some bread, for I haven't had any in weeks. There's someone here to see you. Mother. Son, you look so thin. Yes, I lost a lot of weight here at the prison. Um... French. Yes, here in France. It's all my fault. It should be me behind bars with a French stupid guard, not you. Yes, I agree, Mother. You're a horrible person. Nice and small. Look at my hat. Okay, and... Well, his nose is all whoa, running. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, cut, Ew. cut. Oh, sorry. What happened, Jason? <laughs> can you... It's like a oh gallon. God. I can make it go down, suck it all the way back in. Oh. <laughs> People Brendan. hate me. <laughs> oh, you know, I mean, the, mm -hmm. the kids don't want to do anything. You know, that's, a, that's uh. in my experience, Paula. Yeah. Kids are always like, I don't want to do that. Yeah, uh, yeah. That's... I consider it my job to kind of twist them in the uh, direction of doing stuff. Yeah. I mean, that's what coaching's all about. That's why I love it. I mean, every day I go out there and I twist the kids into doing uh, something they don't want to do. Yeah. Excuse me, waiter. Can I get another one of these as soon as possible? I'm not supposed to mix it with medication, but I'm going to make a rare exception to the rule. All right, everybody gather around. 
Mm -hmm. I uh, took the weekend to think about uh, everything we did wrong on Friday. And I'll tell you something. I watched some professional soccer on television Sunday afternoon. I'll tell you, there's a major gap between what I saw on television and what we are right now. First of all, you're all eight. Hey, and these people were in their 20s. Hey, no, 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 they were a lot older, look at this. but they were a lot this. better. Look at this right here. What's this? What? Brendan, Melissa, what yes, are you doing? nothing. Listen up, right? Yeah, what do you think we were doing? We're talking. Hey, Brendan, you watch your mouth. Oh, I'm sorry. Hey, I'm Brendan. Insulting. Yeah? I'm addressing the team. Uh-huh. Right? That means you listen. That means you too, Melissa. Yes. Right? I'm looking at you too. <laughs> hey, everybody, guess what? Hey, yeah. Brendan. McGurk's going to come after your mom. Brendan. That's going to happen. Brendan, Brendan, sit down. Save your mom. No, I'm not coming after your mom. No. Brendan, you settle down right now. I'm <laughs> this not kidding. happened to me, I All swear right, that's to enough, God. Brendan. No, no, no. Brendan. I'm not finished. Brendan. I'm just getting started here. You know, I've, I've got a question, Eric, for you, maybe. Yes. Could you possibly beat up Mr. McGurk? Don't get my dad oh, in trouble. Medium build. He's a little bit bigger, but, I mean, still, I think you could get I'm, him. I'm wiry. I know. He, here's the thing, Brendan. Do you have a gun? I don't have a gun. Well, we'll get you a gun. Okay. Okay. Brendan, here's... I don't know if this is the right time, but let's try the duck game, Alyssa. Remember we were trying that last time? I remember it. It's yeah. a little Brendan, hard. let me explain it to you really quickly. I'm mm -hmm. going to say a phrase to you in duck talk. Uh, okay. And whoever gets it first wins. You and Melissa, whoever gets it first. Okay, I'm ready. Uh, That's a hard one, Dad. I've been drinking and I shouldn't be driving. What? I okay, let me try something simpler. Okay. Ragu? No. Bradley? No. Uh, listen very closely. <laughs> Is that? I'm sorry. I don't know if I'm allowed to say that word. Dad, no curse words. No, it's not a curse word. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> My pants are soaked. Uh, Dad, I think he just you wants have to, to watch win. The road. Uh, yeah. <laughs> hey, that guy just give me the finger. <laughs> like my babysitters to go too far out of their way. If there's a jar that's impossible for the kids to open, then then they, you know, then somebody could help them with it, but largely, I like them to just take care of themselves. Well, if you if you got a babysitter who and they do a good job and the kids like it, uh, then I think it makes the mother look bad. I don't know if this is like the most self-centered way I could think of it, I'm not sure, but now are there the same rules with the babysitter as there are when you go on the date? Are the babysitters supposed to call you up the next day and say it was really great? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, no one called after that date. The waiter called. Apparently, I forgot my hat. I did have a bad time, but... I, no, that's it. I did have a bad time. It was... He's beefy. But I think I would feel better if he did want to. Sure. You thought Dark Side of the Law was the last of the films with that title. You were wrong. Coming to theaters, Dark Side of the Law 2. First of all, welcome back to the force. Feels good to wear the blue again. Guess what? What? Now Officer Brendan's gone bad! He thought he was above the law. He was wrong. And demand number two. Number three. 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 Pizza! Ah. Academy Award nominee Brendan Small gives his most paralyzing performance. I'm sorry! <laughs> Woody Harrelson is electrifying. My mom said I can't eat a lot of cheese right. because it's binding. And then I don't go, and then she has to put her finger. <laughs> Help it go. <laughs> let's just, okay, let's stop doing this. This film is not yet rated. Blah, 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 blah. Uh, hello. Brendan. Yes, hello. I was, uh, <clears throat> just, uh, Trying out a new hair gel. Um, and I, uh, I didn't expect. Uh, did I call you down here, Brendan? No, no. I, uh, I found out where your office was, so I decided to come down and talk to you. Yeah, they hid me way down here. It's I, a nice place. Uh, well, I just started redecorating it. Is it a sleeping bag? Yeah, I just uh, I do some camping sometimes, and occasionally I'll, I'll camp right here. A lot of mirrors in this place. Well, it's feng shui. Right. I, the reason I came here, Mr. Listen, Mr. before you say anything, I, I, I honestly want to clear the air about your mom. No, you don't have to. Well, I know we had a little difficult time in practice, and no. I certainly don't want that to happen no. again, Brendan. You know what? Let me apologize to you, because no, you I, know was, what? Let me apologize. I was acting like a grade-A jerk Wait a minute, there. Brendan, before you go no, on, shut no, up, Brendan, that, for one uh, second, all right? Let me apologize to you. 
I want you to know that everything is fine. We can continue to have a good relationship on the soccer field. Right. I want to make sure that we have a great season this year, and even though that's not going to happen because no one can play soccer on our team. Uh, and I realize I, it's a conflict of interest for me. I shouldn't be dating you, any of the players' moms, except week. Rebecca's mom. I haven't. She came to practice last night, uh, but I'm not going to call her. I thought about it, but then I knew what happened with your mom was I, wrong, and I said, you know what? Well, I did call her, but I'm not going to follow up on it uh, because that would be wrong. Uh, I swear to God, I, I think I'm off women altogether. No, uh, Brendan, let me I tell you a little bit something about women. What's that? Women are like, they're like men. It, but I'll uh, tell you something, men are not like women. Right. Um, when you give, grow up, you'll understand you, what I'm talking about. Will you give her a call? You know what? I, I honestly don't think that after this whole situation with your mom, I, I did some reflecting. Yeah. And I wrote a poem. And I'm not, I'm not going to read you that poem no, because thank, uh, thanks. it's a little personal. Oh. And, and it has some dirty language in it. It's more like a limerick. Uh, but I right. wish I could read it to you because it makes me laugh every time I read it. I think it's a very good limerick. I, I, you know, I'd love to hear it. I well, mean, I'll that, start it off. Okay. Yeah. Hello, small residents. Brendan Small speaking. Uh, Hello. It's, uh, it's Coach McGurk. Oh. How you doing? Hey, Mr. McGurk. How are you? I'm all right. Hello. P Paula. Hi, it's uh, John McGurk, Coach J Coach McGurk. Hi. How you doing? Good. Good. I'm doing great. Really? You don't sound it. What's that? You don't sound great. I've been crying. That's all. I, but it, it's not about anything. I mean, just uh, sometimes I'll get up and I'll, I'll be in a, you know, I'll, I'll cry. Should I have gotten off the phone yet, guys? Brenda, get uh, off the phone. Brendan, I, get I off the phone. I, oh, my gosh. That boy's a genius. He is. So listen, uh, Paula, I, uh, you know, I'm calling because, uh, you know, we had that date and I thought that went great, you know, except for when, uh, when my credit card got declined. I thought that was funny, but you didn't. And I, so I figured I owe you one and, uh, yeah, uh, listen, I've got an idea. What if you don't owe me dinner? There's just so much pressure on dinner. What if we just ran into each other? Like, like we don't plan it. You mean like I just bump into you randomly or arbitrarily, right? Yeah. So not a date, but if I happen to see you, we would you know, chat. Or, exactly. Or if you pick up Brendan from practice, I would maybe, you know, I would run up and I would, uh, you know, we could get a few minutes. That would, that would be, I, not, that not would every. That would be great. I, mean, I don't mean to interrupt again, but, uh, Brendan, get but off I'm, the I'm phone. very proud of both of you. You're both acting like adults. And Brendan, I'm, I'm going to want to talk to you in a minute. I, I'm, I'm going. Oh, he's going. All right. So I think I might see you on Monday. We got Monday practice, yeah. At, at three. At th right? At three o'clock. Okay, then I'll see you there. Or actually, you know, I know a guy at a travel agency who has great deals on cruises. <laughs> I don't know if you're into doing that, but they have like a four-day cruise. Yeah, I, I think we should Islands. just stick to the random bumping. Well, I mean, I'm just saying, and we could do that on Monday. I'm, I'm not oh, saying that... Hey, you know what? I think that's going to be it for me. Well, hold up. I just had a quick thought. There's a ranch I know out in like Nevada. Nevada. They do a uh, horseback classes. They do a whole rodeo thing. H and hello. Spa. Uh, hey. Brendan, hi. Hi. Hello. How did Put your mom back on. She's, no, she's, she's motioning like uh, she's taking a bath. Really? Yeah. How are you? I don't know why she so abruptly gave the phone away. Well, I, I told her I'd want to talk to you for a little while. So oh. we're going to a ranch? Well, it's cause it isn't really for kids. It's, oh. you know. I get you. So what do you want to talk about? I got... I got to go, Brendan. You know what? Jeremy, don't use your hands. Jeremy, don't use these. Uh, when I was a kid, I was on a soccer team at a very experimental school. It was non-goal oriented. <laughs> Dad, are you watching me? I'm, I can't take my eyes off of you. Brendan, come here. Uh, what? Get in there for Jeremy. I don't, I don't want to go. Brendan, get in there. I don't want to go. Jeremy, you're out. Um, Brendan, you're in. Okay, all right. Melissa, you're in too. Brendan, Brendan, mm. you're out. You're out. Okay. What are you doing? Don't do that. What, what's wrong with that? Well, just don't do that. Do something else. Now get back in. Okay. <sighs> you know what? Don't go in all the way. I'm on. Uh, Stay right near me. Should I jog in place or something? Uh, yeah, look like you're playing. Here, co here it comes. Kick it. <laughs> Kick it. <laughs> oh, come on, ref. What are you not going to call that? Uh, oh, come on. The kid got cream. <sighs> what's a 21-year-old kid doing on that team? Oh, I mean, ref, call something. Okay, walk it off. Walk it off. Walk I'll go get off. you a cane because you're blind. Brendan, come out here. Ah, oh, man, this this whole sport.
Sports out of order. He is a tough kid, that kid of yours. Very tough. And who's got the orange slices? Hey, Paul, can I, and uh, forgive me if I'm overstepping my boundaries here, but uh, can I sit on your lap? <laughs> no, I, uh, Brandon was telling me that um, you and, and uh, the coach went out on a date. Is that, is that true? Yeah. Yeah. Well, I, I, no, I certainly know my business, but <clears throat> he, he seemed kind of rattled by the whole thing. The coach? No, Brendan. I think of all three of us, I handled it the best. Let's get into the game, parents. Get into the game. Speaking of getting into the game, ref, get into the game! Yeah, and I really, I apologize. It really is none of my business. I hate this sport, Brendan. I mean, I hate this sport. No, you don't. No, I was just thinking that we met, for, I guess, for the first time at the PTA meeting two years ago, and... Uh, I meant to tell you, by the way, there's something I meant to tell you two years ago at the PTA meeting. Yeah. I'm uncomfortable around you. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, it slipped my mind for the last two years. I've been meaning to tell you that I really think we're not going to hit it off. Hey, am I out of my mind, or is your dad sitting really close to my mom? You're out of your mind. Am I? They're just talking. Okay, They're I here to support that. the team. Paul, in, in two weeks uh, on Saturday morning, Melissa and I are giving a recital. And I would love it if you and Brendan can join us. You're giving a recital? Well, I, I you know, she's playing the piano, I'm playing the violin. It's, it's, um... Really? It's, um, it's an E minor. It goes, uh... Hey, yo, yo, mop! I'm sorry! Dad, put the... You said you weren't bringing the violin! It's, Paula made I'm me... I'm playing get... soccer! Play Freebird! Brendan, don't encourage him. And get away from my mom! <laughs> 